Hey, I'm Chris. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about a tutorial on the difference between contact lists and groups. Now, I've, this is an, actually an update to an old tutorial that I've done in the past. Uh, and after looking at that, uh, before I sent it out to a staff member, I looked at it and I was like, eh, it's kind of dated on what it actually looks like. So uh, this is an update. If I'm uh, working out of Outlook online, you want to make sure that uh, you're not in the Mail app. You actually come over to the People app. And we're going to talk about uh, contacts and groups. If you see it nested like this, uh, you can expand these out by clicking on these little arrows. And you can see your contact lists or your contacts. Deleted folders. Uh, you can organize your contact lists or your contacts uh, in general. And then you've got your groups here. And uh, you can see what you're a member of, what you're an owner of. And actually, I'm an uh, owner of quite a few. Uh, groups, but I don't want an email group. Uh, I know it sounds like, hey, I just want to create a distribution group, but that's not what this uh, section is intended for. With Microsoft having like Microsoft Teams or Microsoft Yammer, think of like a uh, like a social media for internal organizations or businesses or education. Uh, that's where this would come in handy. But if you're trying to email a, a whole bunch of people. You're going to want to use a contact list. So if I go into contact lists, here you can see all the contact lists that I've got created. Now to create one, I'm going to go up in the upper left hand corner. Not on new contact list for an individual, but I want to use a contact list. So I click on that. I'm going to give it a name. Uh, you can add your email addresses in here and they can be either within the K-12 system or uh, a personal email address, if you will and then a description if you will if you want and after that you hit create and from there you've got your distribution list or contact list if I double click on this uh, cool people instructional coaches here you can see this list and I can edit this take out names add names you name it that's it for now. That's all I've got. If you like this, please hit the thumbs up down below. Please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you do, hit the notification bell at the top. That way, when new content's pushed out, you'll be the first to know. Have a great rest of the day.